McAllister was on scene to capture Asheville's cleaning up process. It was awful. It's hard to process that moment. I, I keep thinking about it, but um, I felt dizzy and like I might pass out. Recovery efforts are underway in Asheville after Hurricane Helene tore through Western North Carolina. A little bit of shock since we've had so many of these like sort of false alarms, a little bit of like hurricanes and floods in the past and nothing this traumatic has ever happened. I'm here at the Asheville Community Movement Gymnasium where water levels were up to here during Hurricane Helene. Over 20 people have come to help out, move debris, mud, and other equipment that got destroyed during this process. The water, like obviously, came in here, broke the dock door, and then there's this part where it's just like, there were like five, four stars on a beam. They're still running. Like, it's insane. And throughout all the destruction, they're fighting to save their home away from home. This place is such a great community and everyone's so like attached to it that I think they really wanted to help. After I went to visit one of my friends like two days after the hurricane came through and we were both begging our parents to come by and just see what if we could help. We've got a lot of kids in Nashville that are really sad right now. This is just like their second home. We want to we want to be here for our for our family, which is our community. Like we love these kids. They are like they are everything to us. The Asheville community is still optimistic even when faced with wreckage. They're coming. The whole the whole nation is going to help you guys out. Everybody cares. And that that gives me hope. Fiona McAllister, ENN Tonight. As the Asheville Community Movement Gym is finding some relief, they hope to reopen in the next few months.